Three of the top four seeds held serve on Thursday with the six-seeded American Eagles recording the only upset of the night. The defending champs will continue on the road with a trip to second-seeded Colgate at 4 p.m. on Sunday, while the top-seeded Bucknell Bison will host number four Lafayette at 2 p.m. Both games will be on CBS Sports Network. The winners will advance to Wednesday's championship game on CBS Sports Network. Holy Cross was 30 seconds away from knocking off the tournament's top seed, but Bucknell's Chris Haas added to his great night to keep the Bison alive. Let's take a look at all the highlights from Thursday. Bucknell used a 13-0 run in the first half against Holy Cross to take a 21-13 lead, and Haas' second three of the half helped make it 36-27 at the break. A 12-2 run to start the second pushed the lead out to 48-32. Malcolm Miller, who scored a game-high 34 points, turned it on, scoring 15 points during a five-and-a-half-minute stretch to cut a 13-point deficit to 67-66 with 4.44 left. Holy Cross jumped in front with 55 seconds left, but Haas came through with his biggest basket, drawing a foul to tie the game at 76 with 25 seconds left. In overtime, Bucknell built an 84-77 lead with free throws, and DJ McClay put away the 90-83 win with his fast break dunk. Colgate ran out in front against Navy in the first half and took a 27-22 lead into the locker room. Luke Rowe helped push it out to 36-24 in the second half, and Alex Raymond's layup with 11.02 left put Colgate up 48-35. The Raiders continued to pull away and advanced to the semifinals with a 72-62 win. Lehigh's Tim Kempton scored a team-high 20 points, leading the Mountain Hawks out to a 27-23 lead at the break against American. Pee Wee Gardner immediately cut it to one with a three-pointer to start the second half. That sparked a 24-12 run, capped by Jesse Reed's three to make it 47-39 with 11-18 left. Reed hit another three with 4.29 remaining to put American up by 10, and Jalen Ray's fast break layup put away the 68-62 upset win. Boston U opened at Lafayette on a 14-4 run in the first seven minutes, but it all went downhill after that. The Leopards used a 23-5 run to build a 27-19 lead, and Joey Tuszynski's three-pointer sent Lafayette into the half up 40-34. The Leopards opened the second on a 17-2 run as Nick Lindner hit one of his five threes in the game, and Seth Henricks joined in with a three to make it 65-41 with 12-24 left. Dan Trist, who posted a double-double, helped the Leopards close out the 89-64 win. Sunday semifinals will be on CBS Sports Network, and we'll have all of the highlights and previews on PatriotLeague.tv leading into Wednesday. Wednesday's championship game. For the Page League Network, I'm Melanie Pulowski.